Hi, my name is Chicka Chess and in this video I will be showing you guys 50 build details you can add to your world right now. These tips are really simple and easy, so make sure to say that till the end of the video. And if you enjoy, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Thank you so much, I really appreciate it and have fun. Okay, first of all, we have a, a well. Basically, it's just really easy. The stairs with the water in them. I mean, it's nothing special, but still a simple thing you can add to your world. Second of all, we have a fountain. And I know there's loads of different fountain designs. And this is like the simplest that there is out there. You know, go on Pinterest, find some inspo, build a cool fountain. It, it's so easy. And over here, we have a wagon with like some hay bales on here. But you can also put like chests or melons or whatever. This on a road or something like that would be really cool. Now here we have a custom tree and i know some people struggle with custom trees but basically it's just a lot of practice and there's loads of youtube videos out there on how to do this but obviously you can just use saplings i mean it's not really that big of a deal now here we have bushes and some rocks it's so easy to add to your world and it brings so much detail in it here we have a pond and i really like this one i really like the flowers around it and the sand and the gravel and stuff my fish despawn no I spawned fish in here, guys. Crying, don't hit me up. You can never go wrong with a pond, right? Now here we have like a market, a little, you know, little marketplace. We have a, a crate pile over here. We have some hay bales over here. I really like these market store designs with the campfires here. Now right here we have the flower fields. You know, you can go for any flowers, basically. I went for like a pinkish white kind of theme, but any colors would do. We love flowers, guys, don't we? Then there's obviously also wheat fields or just any crops basically, carrots or potatoes or just anything. I added these like stone barriers kind of around it a little bit, but uh, that's just that's just detail. And then we have a scarecrow, guys. Look at it. Look at it. I love this so much. I love it so much. This one's super quick. A wheelbarrow. Do I have to say anything else, guys? Chicken coop. It, it is me, but like built different i guess i'm kidding i'm glad i'm not in here oh. <laughs> it looks a bit uh, crowded anyways this is a good way to you know collect your eggs or whatever I, I don't know or just have chickens i guess you can also make like a little outside place if you want because it's kind of small now here we have a crane and i really like this design this would be perfect in like a mine or something like that like a a cave build type of thing you could even hang like an ore or something like that or something like you you kind of yeah, y you know, you get the point, right? Like in a mine type of thing. Anyways, over here we have beehives, and I love these so much. Like, bees are just one of the cutest mobs in Minecraft, in my opinion. I, I did spawn bees, but they might have also despawned. <laughs> now here we have, like, ancient runes. I, like, there's a lot of different things you can do for this. Like, I know I made kind of a design in here, but you can also just make, like, I don't know, like, broken down things, like... I know. I feel like ancient runes just give the places a bit more history. And we can't forget the campfire. We, we can't forget the campfire. It is so cozy and I always add campfires to my world, guys. This is probably one of my favourite ones in this whole video. An archery range? Like, I know many people don't really think about that, but it's so cool. It's like, I, you can like shoot arrows at all. You can like shoot arrows and it's so fun. Especially in the middle of woods or something. Okay, now promise not to laugh at this one, okay? But I- statues. There are statues with nice designs and actual shape in them, like these. And then there are statues like- like my statues, you know, like snake and worm. These are my pretty statues. You can do these or you, you can actually make a design in them. Over here we have a vineyard. I really like this one. It looks so cute with the spruce leaves and the berry bushes and stuff like that. Guys, a bird bath. I This is one of my favorites too. I'm just gonna demonstrate this real quick, okay? Look at that. Obviously we can't forget the picnics, a little cake, a flower pot as like a cup type of thing and just, you know, a, a fun picnic place. Now right here we have paths because obviously you need paths in your world where you need to connect everything to each other. Come on now. This is a loads of different path designs. I have three right here. We have like a darker one, a black stone stuff. And then over here we have some stones and here we kind of have more like a cause the puzzle like kind of like that more like a path path type of thing now hear me out guys a fallen tree i know it looks kind of weird but when you think about it like a tree that fell over you know 
This one's also one of my favorites, guys. Boat racks. If you have like dogs or something, please put these there. They look so good and it's like, it's so cute. I really love this one. Now over here we have a log pile, which is some, some oak logs and some campfires as smaller logs and just some spruce here and there. I really like this one. It kind of doesn't really have a function, but it's, it's just there and it, and it looks good. Obviously you need to light up your streets and your pathways, so we need some street lights here. Now here are three designs I made, but there's again loads of other designs out there. Yeah, light, light up those streets guys. Over here we have a little storage shed with some chests and some barrels and stuff like that so you can store your stuff. Now right here guys we have an animal sanctuary. I love this one. Oh my bird is in here. I made a fox sanctuary but obviously you can make sanctuaries for any other mob. Now right here we have like a gazebo type of thing. I really like this with the leaves on the roof. It is just really cute and like open but also not open right here we have flower beds why not guys why not have flower beds we love flowers i i also have some other plants here but we love plants we love that and this is definitely also one of my favorites a tree swing guys it is so look at it this is amazing now right here we have a barbecue and i really like this one with the looms and like the i know sausage or something <laughs> i don't know just some barbecue guys right here we have benches you can just put these long paths or roads or anywhere and here we have a little car with some storage just on a path or on a road or anything like that you can easily just put one of these carts not to forget we have three things here in the sky we have a hot air balloon which looks kind of round but it's also it's also kind of cute i guess you have a little plane you can obviously make bigger planes but like i just wanted to keep it simple and right here we have a helicopter and i, I know that and it's like doesn't look very good but you kind of can see it, it's a helicopter I, I guess also for this one bigger designs are also there <laughs> I'm just saying. Now moving on to a world that's not flat because some things didn't really fit in with the flat world. Right here we have, well I'll call it a river, but I kind of mean the side of the river. You can detail it with like some sand and some gravel, sugar cane, some wheat, some flowers, and it looks way better than just a normal side of a river. Obviously you can add some colour into your seas or rivers or whatever with a coral reef and I really like this too, it's, it's just so colourful and bright. Then we have boats, of course boats, we can have big boats, we can have small boats, we can have pirate boats, we can have boats, we can also have canoes. And of course a beach, because who doesn't want a beach guys? Who, who doesn't want a beach? Right here we have a bridge, because you know, we need to keep swimming through the water every time to get to the other side. It's not very fun, we all know that's not very fun, so make a bridge! make a bridge guys now this is one of my favorites too because i think it turned out really well but a waterfall is amazing to add to your world i really like this with the leaves and just all of the greens and the stones and stuff like that i added in some cobblestone some normal stone and some andesite which gives it some texture the smoke is from these campfires on here by the way um which gives it that cool effect then we obviously also have a little park over here it's just really simple you know the benches some flowers some trees really easy and right here we have stepping stones i really really like these just like it's so simple and you can like jump around i know i really really like these and the last thing i actually can't believe we're ending with this one I, I didn't mean to do that anyways we have a cave just a little cave thingy i know i added like blood and and the skull but that's only a that's only if you want detail and like mysterious stuff but you can obviously just do it without that and get some leaves in there get some water you know kind of go for the new update you could even put in like your nether portal or something right here that would be sick like that i guess <laughs> i just quickly did it and it looks pretty cool you know it's qu it's quite cool anyways that was the video thank you so much for watching i really really appreciate it if you like this video make sure to drop a like and subscribe it really helps me out a lot and i just hope you enjoyed basically have a nice day guys bye bye